James Schramko here with an internet marketing update. This topic today is video sales letters. How can you ensure that you get the highest conversion? Well, it's all about relevancy. Make sure that you connect with your target audience in the very beginning or you'll lose them straight away. I've been watching a lot of heat maps from training videos that I've put up there using my favorite video player, Wistia and it shows trends. You can see people stay with the video if it's relevant or they drop away if you start talking about anything that's not relevant. So perhaps you want to remind yourself of the old formula, AIDA. A stands for attention. You get the person's attention. I stands for interest. Hold their interest. D stands for desire. Build desire. And then A is action. Ask them to do something. So if you go back and have a look at your sales landing pages, make sure that you're complying to that formula, that you really are engaging, that you're relevant, that you've got interest and you've got desire, and that you actually ask people to do something that helps them and helps you. Now, this week we did a conversion tracking training in FastWeb Formula. The audience were very excited about it. We covered all sorts of ways that you can track conversions and Everything from using the Google Analytics tool right through to looking at heat maps on your website, looking at video play data, and looking at special uh, clickable links from exit pops and PDFs and whether PRs work. I was able to dig through a lot of the data. But the most important thing is firstly to track. The second most important thing is to make sure you track the right things. If you're getting all this stuff, but you're not tracking the right things, it's a waste of time. If you're tracking nothing, then you're probably wasting your time. At the very minimum, start tracking things so that you can go back and analyze it later and work out where your best use of your time is and focus heavily on those things. And that's when your profit lifts up. Another topic is scripts. Somebody asked in FastWeb Formula, what do you do when you buy a script that you have to install on your own server? Can it be installed on your average HostGator reseller account? Usually the answer is yes. Is it complicated to install? Depends on what you're buying. Quite often you'll have to create a database and then upload scripts with an FTP file and then go to special pages like the admin page and make settings and then delete certain files. It could be about the same level of complexity as assembling IKEA furniture. Now, here's my tip. When you buy scripts, uh, whether it's a, a database thing that uh, protects downloads, whether it's a help desk or whatever, usually the, per the person selling the script will have an option to do the install for you. And it's usually like $20 or $50, or if it's a very complicated script, it might be more. I suggest you take that option if you don't have your own favorite programmer and if you don't want to install it yourself. I used to install these things and I don't do it anymore because my time is more valuable working on other things like creating content and driving traffic. So I happily pay a programmer. The person who created the script is going to be an expert at installing the script on the most common hosting scenarios. So good luck with installing your programs. Hopefully you get someone else to do it and it's going to get you doing the things that are going to give you the most value in your business. I look forward to seeing you inside FastWeb Formula. If you're not a member yet, make sure you join. Have a great week.